Thomas Wolfe lived only till age 37, and yet he is one of the big names in literature. Look, Homeward Angel was his first novel. He was only, I think, 29 years old when he wrote that one, and that's to this day is his most famous, although he only, he only wrote four of them. And they, one of the reasons he only wrote four, not only because he died of tubercular meningitis, I believe was, was what killed him at age 37, but he wrote these long, sprawling, ornate novels. Uh, he, his editor was Maxwell Perkins, who was the same editor who edited F. Scott Fitzgerald and Ernest Hemingway. And um, I can tell you that he had, according to my guest, a uh, novelist spotlight who talks about the life and times of Thomas Wolfe, Max Perkins and Thomas Wolfe have ep epic battles because Max Perkins needed to cut down the 2,000 pages to something more equivalent to uh, normal book publishing. And uh, as things turned out, uh, they battled one another, but Thomas Wolfe always respected him. Who, who wouldn't respect Maxwell Perkins, a man who brought uh, F. Scott Fitzgerald and Ernest Hemingway and other authors to, to life? Now, uh, Joseph Bentz is a Thomas Wolfe scholar. He teaches at Pacific Azusa University. We spent an hour talking about the life of Thomas Wolfe, uh, the libel lawsuits against him, um, of course, his early death, uh, the tensions that he had uh, with Hemingway and with F. Scott Fitzgerald, his, his birth in Asheville, North Carolina, uh, one, of, one of the Carolinas' proud sons and, uh, and so on. And um, the Thomas Wolfe Memorial Museum in Asheville, North Carolina. And uh, Joseph Bentz, the, my guest, is uh, um, uh, one of the, art he's the articles editor of the Thomas Wolfe Review. They put out an annual publication that keeps Thomas Wolfe's reputation uh, and his writing alive. And uh, obviously done a good job of it because Thomas Wolfe, uh, he makes headlines even to this day. Novelist Spotlight Podcast is where you will find it. It's episode number 133. I hope you'll join me and Joseph Bentz there. Uh, Joseph is just a wealth of knowledge. I've just skimmed the surface of some of the subjects that we talk about. Again, Novelist Spotlight Podcast on all major podcasting platforms. I hope you'll listen in.